then? Wait. Okay. Hello, everybody, and welcome to this special episode of Jurassic World Alive. Today, we have. No, don't look at that. You've got horses behind you. Look at those. Well, today, I'm Chris Pratt. I mean, Owen. I always. I always. Oh, God damn. Today, we're debuting the Jeep Wrangler. Jeep 18. I was allowed to take it out because I've heard some assets are out of containment. So we're about to round them up. I've got my my GPS signal thing. GPS signal thing over here. That's how we're gonna track down the dinosaurs. But before we do that, I haven't had a chance really to show this baby off. Uh, because when me and Winnie went down to collect it, it was freezing cold and I'd never driven a manual before. I had driven a manual, it had just been like seven years. It's an old car, so the gear shifts are like really quick and yada yada yada. Anyway, anyway. So this isn't the Jeep that you might remember in my last video that I did on the cars. And I actually sold that one and had this one imported. That's why, if you can see here, come here with Nick, come here. Good luck. There is a, it's left wheel drive, which means it's American means that it's legit. Also, it's incredibly windy, so I apologize in advance if my hair's not to your satisfaction. Never to my satisfaction. I, I, well, I mean, I love you guys. Back here, we reached the rear of the car. You can see we have the sand, it's a Jeep Wrangler Sahara sand beige, as uh, Gray would like to say. We do have the OEM rims. We have the, uh, the hoops. These are the ones that were on it. Um, they are not screen accurate, but since recording, we have discovered that the KC lights that were on the back, that I had another one, are actually not screen accurate. Uh, what a shame. But what it does mean is that, uh, like, it's pretty close. It doesn't really matter. So I might not even change those. Here we have the whip antenna, the classic thing, which all of the uh, Motorola savers were uh, talk through, which I haven't got it hooked up, but you could do if you really wanted to. We have the side steps on as well. Um, so this is all like screen accurate at the moment, the best of our abilities. And also, if you see here, objects in mirror are closer than they appear. Yes. You can have a look just right there. Very dark, yes. When you can, when you can change, change. There you go, there you can see it. Objects in mirror are hard to focus on. Uh, they're very. Uh, so I want. <coughs> so I have been meaning to make an episode on this beauty for a while. I just, I had it in mind that I was gonna do it for uh, Jurassic World: The Life. However, um, yeah, I was in America when it came out, and unfortunately, I couldn't just ship it back over to America to do it. So yeah, I'm really happy with this. We actually have a soft top on this bad boy. It, you you might be fooled. It is very sunny today, but um, bitterly cold with the wind. But we, we are now going to embark on an adventure to go and catch some dinosaurs. So join me in the vehicle, would you please? No. You bloody well will. Get in, woman. <laughs> oh no, I broke it. There, there he is. There I am. Like, aren't I gorgeous? So here we are in the vehicle. And I thought as like a little treat. I know I spoiled you rotten. We would look at our new dinosaurs and hopefully it should be up. Uh, right next to me, because I'm pro. And I have, yes, I managed to. I was like two DNA off, and I managed to get it. Of course, off screen. But we have, finally, the T-Rex. And let's make that bad boy. Oh, yeah. So this is the first time, this is Rexy. Rexy from Jurassic Park has 1,949 health, which is really good. And 606 attack. Oh, my God. That is amazing. Okay, let's have a look at it. Oh, oh. Oh, there she is. Ooh, ooh, gives me all. Later, Claire. Not, not right now. Um, so, ooh, it has a different hybrid. Hold on. We, we, we need to check that out. What, what's this hybrid before we, before we do anything? Trichosaurus, and it's made from a dinosaur we don't have, and it's unique. That's the first dinosaur I've seen that's unique. Trichosaur Trichosaurus has the raw, the raw predatory power of the Tyrannosaurus and the defensive capabilities of the Ankylosaur. So it's two epics to make a unique. Now, mostly they would be legendaries. So I think unique's even better than a legendary, um, which is pretty damn amazing. 
So yes, we'll have a look at its attacks. Let's have a look. It costs 2,000 to get them, but that's okay. We have armor piercing strike, that's okay. And then the uh, 1.5, and then a times two piercing uh, strike, sort of with thick skin. Yeah, so it, it's, it has basically the same attacks as the Gen 2 T-Rex that we've already unlocked. But except for this time, we're gonna add it to our roster. We'll, we'll probably kick out, uh, I'd say, Enosaurus. We don't really need him. Make way for the queen, baby! Oh, no, no, don't switch it out. There we go. And also, you guys have told me to click the button. So there you go. We got different animations. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. And the other one, I think they have two animations. Oh, yeah. Oh, that looks awesome. But... You feel it? Go, 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 go! Oh, go, 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 go! I didn't realize I was gonna make it! Oh! Is it gone? Look, is it gone? Have a look! It's gone! It's gone! It's gone! Woo, that was close! Oh, God! I need to go, must go faster! Must go faster! Oh, that was a bit touch and go there! But, I'm gonna go to a place, we're gonna go to a place! Where there's definitely gonna be dinosaurs! So, is this where we're gonna go? This is a game trail, Whitney. Carnivores hunt on game trails. I set up base camp here in the middle of a swamp. But I've had two, I've been on too many safari trips with rich dentists to listen to another cockamamie idea. Okay. Is there a way to get to it from the other side of those hedges? Ah, uh, there could be. Na 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 na. Jurassic jungle. It's like we're taking a walk in the park 65 million years ago. Come on, let's go. Brought my trusty pokey stick just in case we come across any. anything like that. Richard Attenborough impression. Right over there is what we like to call imagination. And they say that Barry is the more interesting character when really it's obviously it's gonna be me because I'm the one. You hear that? Easy, easy. We know each other. We had coffee once. Remember that one time? You know me. Three, two, go, 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 I know what you're thinking. He's wearing the same jumper as last time. He is. I, yeah, he always wears the same jumper. It's because I like it. So hopefully you guys like that skit. If this, the, if this is the episode I'm thinking I put it in front of. I think. Hello! I've got even better news than a funny skit. I took the bus. I was on it for about an hour. I was on it for an hour and a bit. My iPhone almost ran out of battery by the end. So you can see we have 30,000 coin and oh, look at all that. Yes, we have the T-Rex. We got it earlier on. Uh, it is here in the scene. Um, but also I have 4,000 eupocephalus. Upos also, sorry if I sound a bit weird. Um, I've just had like a filling done. So this side of my mouth is still numb. It's the, the feeling. Ooh, the feeling is coming back. <laughs> Ooh, exciting to screw dinosaurs. Screw all that nonsense. <laughs> so I was worried that I would sound weird. But now that I'm moving about, I think it's it's sort of going away. Because I was worried I'd, be, I'd bite my lip. My gum, sorry. But anyway, we got so much to do. Because look at this, even so much of this. And New Blood Jungle, what I thought was going to be... 
like the regular forest is different. So we're gonna look at that. We're also gonna be, as you can see, I've got four new dinosaurs. Um, do you wanna know what they are? Because I was on that bus for an hour. I went all the way around to a place I'd never, I didn't even, I'd never been before. Uh, and then it like, anyway, I'll, I'll tell the story while we start um, upgrading dinosaurs. Um, so yeah, oh, 2000 quid. So yes, you'll notice Proceratosaurus is actually in my usable dinosaurs now. And that is because it's it's really good. <laughs> it's not because of its attack and its health. Its health is pretty bad. Why it's in my group or my team is because of its speed, 124, which is actually really quick. I think the fastest dinosaur is Utah Raptor, 132. Um, also, that distinct impact, 1.5 times damage, as well as 50% re reduction on theirs for two turns is really good. So uh, I was like, actually, no, that's a really good dinosaur. Also, I bumped into Tyrannosaurus quite a few times. So uh, we can definitely level that up to level 12, giving it a 94 health and an extra 23 attack. And um, also, if you want to know how to get AR on your, um, on your iPad or whatever, all you need to do is uh, enable camera, like controls. Um, otherwise, the ability won't show up. And I saw somebody comment in, uh, about that in the last video. So there you go. A little handy, helpful tip from Eva. <laughs> so yeah, like that was interesting. At one point, my uh, driver got, like stopped. Like, he stopped the bus. I was on the upper deck. He stopped the bus and it, it was like starting to move. And I'm like, what? What, what's going on here? <laughs> but he was like doing exercises and stuff. And I was like, ah, there's nobody else on. I didn't even think he knew I was on. I was just like there like, yep, I'm going to ignore this. <laughs> so yeah, we could get a uh, woohoo saurus. Oh, I'm getting numb in the mouth now. Like, like tingles. Ugh. Um, to level 12, which is our first rare at level 12 with 2000 health and 564. I bumped into a lot of these, actually. A lot of woohoo sauruses. So many um, Eupocephaluses, but I didn't upgrade this from last time. I don't even know how that managed to happen. So uh, we're going to get a Margasaur up to um, probably level 9, actually. Because it has loads of attack, loads of health, and some really good attacks, just like Argentinosaurus. It, it, I did realize most of my team's slow. So, uh, they have a lot of health and a lot of attack, but they're kind of slow. And really... Oh, we can get level 9! Here we go! 2,095 and oh, 460 attack, really good. Um, it's attacks are, uh, yeah, it can turn down the speed 90% uh, for two turns and 50% for three turns. So it'll be the slowest thing in the world when it's done with that. And they're both 1.5 times damage, so really good. Um, there was something I was gonna say actually. Oh yeah, people wanted me to like click on the dinosaurs to make them do their other animations. So there you go. I can't obviously do it for uh, all the dinosaurs or else we'll be here till God knows when. Uh, Eupocephalus does actually have a hybrid, which is Amargo, Amargo, Amargocephalus, but it does need Amargo Sword to be one more level higher and I haven't bumped into one yet. So the only chance I've got of getting Amargo Sword higher is in the DNA crates, which we do have. Um, but I am tempted to get Eupocephalus higher than level 12, but uh, 4,000... 4,000 DNA he's got for him, I've got for it, uh, could be used to make a hybrid. So, um, like, stuff like a Padasaur will definitely upgrade because um, you need them up to a certain level to make a hybrid. And this one definitely does have a hybrid. Uh, we may even get to level 7. That means every episode we went up at least one level, I think. I think so. Um, so, uh, oh yeah, that's right, Gorgasaur. Got, found a Gorgasaur for once. Took me bloody time, but I got one level seven. Gorgosaur is really good, actually. It doesn't have too much health, but um, its attack and everything else is uh, pretty good. Its speed's not so great, but that, the ferocious strike, 50% damage, like extra uh, for three turns. That's a, that's really good. Also, Gorgosuchus, which we don't have just yet. Uh, I bumped into two Megalosauruses, uh, one after another. They were like both in the same spot. Um, I saw some really cool dinosaurs while I was out, actually. <gasps> we could get it to level 8? Heck yeah, let's get it to level 8! Now, he doesn't have great health and not great attack. And you might be wondering, not great health, not great attack, no defense, and 102 speed. What is the point in Megalosaurus? It's absolute crap. But, yeah, this is where it gets interesting. Bleeding Bite. It does half the damage, but for three turns, it does an extra half damage. So, it's like... 
maybe maybe that's actually kind of worth it. I haven't looked into it though. Um, didn't see. I saw one Majungasaurus while I was out. Everything else was Eupocephalus, Nundasuchus, or Enosaurus. Um, so we'll. Oh yeah, I got a lot of Sukumimuses as well. A lot of Sukumimuses. Before we do some of these, how about? Do you want to see what I got? Do you want to see it? Like, how could you best T-Rex? You got a T-Rex at the start of the episode. How could you best it? Stegoceratops. I saw three of them while I was out. And I managed to, like, catch all of them. As well as Spinosaurus. Saw two of those. But, you know, we'll start with Stegoceratops. Because I don't know how good this thing's going to be. I've never unlocked a hybrid before. But here we go. That's why I got, like, 200. So there it is. Oh, we can get it to level 12 already! No way! So there it is! It looks so cool! It looks better than the one from Jurassic World the game, I've got to admit. Um, so what's its stats? 1,876 health and 494 attack! And it has four moves! Increase speed by 75%, slow them, stun them, and his regular attack has a 10% chance to stun. That's so good! And of course, we're gonna get him to level 12! Meaning he's got- Oh, that's- 15% defense and 115 speed. Which means it's it's faster than all the sauropods. It's faster than T-Rexes. So, yeah, this thing's really good. Oh, man, that's awesome! We haven't even got the others to level 10, so we can't make it. Oh, I'm really happy. I'm really happy with that. That's great. Uh, but yeah, how about we make Spinosaurus as well? That This, um, I bumped into two of these. He looks so doofy, like front on, his cheeks are so fat. He's like, yeah. <laughs> but we'll get him. There it is. Yes, Spinosaurus. Now that is a thumbnail you want. You want, you want loads of views on your video, YouTube videos. Put Spinosaurus in it. <laughs> so 1,000 attack, sorry, 1,000 health and 387 attack. It does have exposed weak spot. Deal one times damage, then target is vulnerable for this turn and the next three turns. Vulnerable? Does that mean you get critical hits? Yeah, that would be interesting. Uh, so, so close to a level 7. Didn't quite get there. Uh, Caprasuchus. Um, I think we got some of this DNA because I did not get 500. I did catch one just before. Uh, I think two, actually. 1,075 and 356. He's actually better than Spinosaurus. We'll see how high we can get this guy. But I want to get to level 7. That's what I want to do. We're also going to do battles as well. I'll show you the new battle arena because it looks really good. Um, I'm not going to spoil it, but it looks really good. So we'll get it up to level 9, possibly. Uh, really... Oh, yep, yeah. level nine. There it is. We are getting close to level seven. I really want to be level seven because then we can get even more DNA. So next time I go out on the bus, <laughs> um, I can uh, catch more DNA for each one I see. And also, this is, yeah, Tenotosaurus. This is uh, a new um, herbivore. Uh, so, not, I was going to say sauropod. What, what are they called? Hadrosaur. That's the one. I think the Hadrosaur or something like that. I don't know. I don't like saying things because there's there's people who know way more than me who watch these videos and like, oh, <laughs> so oh, it looks really good. Uh, what does 470 health and 343 attack? It's yeah, it's level six, so it's actually pretty good. Now I want to put this guy in my team, Utah Raptor. Um, I managed to come across um, two of these out today. Um, its health's not very good, but it's a, it lit, it's its attack. That's uh, really going to show you how good it is. I was hoping to get level 11, but uh, not quite. Um, so its pounce attack deals two times damage. So it basically does a thousand attack in one hit. And also if you do have critical impact, um, you do about 700 damage and have a 40% chance of a critical. So if you do 700 damage and then I think it's maybe double for a critical, you'll get over a thousand. So I, and its speed, 128. I think the raptor may be quicker. Um, and that's one I definitely want to level up. So, oh, let's just level up some of these dinosaurs and then see where we're at. So, some, does Iguanodon have a hybrid? It doesn't have a hybrid. Ooh. But, this is still early days. So, they may put new dinosaurs in and new hybrids in. And I would be very surprised if they didn't. This is still in soft launch. So, it's not ready to go public. And just like with Jurassic World, the game, when that was in soft launch, as soon as it went public, you had hybrids. You had, like, Indominus Rex and everything else. Um, didn't bump into too many Iguanodons, not gonna lie. Um, 
who else? We should definitely do Stegosaurus. Also, I've got to, like, put the music quiet in the background, actually. Uh, because I can hear it. And I did find out how to turn the music off. So there we go. There we go. No music. No music. <laughs> okay, John Williams on me back like, You use my music. I want money. I don't know why he sounds like that, but he does now. <laughs> so there you go. Level 10 Stegosaurus has loads of attack. Uh, not too much health, though. Um, but that means we can start getting towards more Stegoceratopses. Uh, Triceratops, I barely bump into any of these guys. Barely any. But we're getting closer. And then as soon as you're, you're like, like, able to, um, get these guys DNA for a hybrid, I would suggest don't shell out any coin to upgrade them. Just fuse them. And that's exactly what I'm gonna do for Enosaurus, Nundasuchus, and the other one. I can't remember what it is. So this is basically a new one, Tijongosaurus. Um, seems like a healthier version of Stegosaurus. Maybe even with better attack. We'll also get the Gen 2 Triceratops. Guys, leave in the comments telling me what your favorite dinosaur is and if you want to see it in a, in a battle, because I can easily switch them in. Um, and because it might be a case of that dinosaur's really good, I just don't know at the moment in comparison to what I've got. And I might switch that in if I read the comments, so... And I thought it was a cool way to get you guys involved as well. Because, you know, I go out and about and I do my thing. But when you come back to the, the command center, we can, you know, share ideas and stuff like that. So, um, Sukumimus, I'm definitely going to level up. I didn't... I saw one Parasaurolophus out in the distance and that was it. I was really surprised. There was one point when I was on the bus and um, I was running out of, like, darts to fire. So I was like, oh, should I save in case, like, there's something rare? I'll save. And I was like, there was dinosaurs on me. It's like, I could get those, but you know what? I'll wait. And as soon as I did that, Stegoceratops came up. And I was like, yeah, there we go. That's what I get. So we'll keep on evolving Sukumimus. Because I feel like it's... You know, it doesn't have too great attack and health. But it does have that bleed damage. Um, so it is still a pretty good dinosaur. And we are running out of coin. I just realized. It speeds really good, actually. 121. Uh, we got 13,000 coin. So we're below half of what we had. I'm definitely going to upgrade Parasaurolophus. I don't think it's going to be very good. Only level 5. Again, I don't see any of these. I wonder if it's just UK. Like, if UK it's rare for. It could be. It could be very likely. I'll try to point the microphone more towards my face. Hello. <laughs> yeah. I, like, I don't like getting too close because then in post I have to go, oh, turn it down because it blows out the microphone. Uh, Monolophosaurus... Could be good. Yeah, I've, I've seen a couple of these, but there's no point in getting them, I find. Like, I'd rather save my darts for something better. And the fact that it has 102 speed, 280 attack, it's, and it has no good moves. There is no reason to have Lothorax. I'm sure it'll have a hybrid, though. And that'll be the only reason to upgrade it. Um, so, one thing is I want to do is get DNA for this. So, we have so many Nundasuchuses, so many Enosauruses. And because this is a really good dinosaur, um, like, it will be. Not at the moment, but it will be. Um, I thought, why not? Let's do this. Because uh, at level 7, he gets, like, 100 extra health and um, a little bit more attack. Oh, there we go. 30. That's what we want. One more 30, please. Or oh, 25. 25 will do. And we've also got the uh, crates to open as well. Uh, 10. And we'll do one more. And that should be enough. Yo, well, it was just enough. And how much to, ha like, upgrade? How much? 200. So there we go. Level 7. Oh, no, 74 extra. 17. It's It does have defense, though. I'm not going to lie. That's pretty darn good. Um, we have 4,000 Nundasuchuses. 3,000 Enosauruses. You know what? Let, we'll get it to level 8. We'll get it to level 8. But also, there's another hybrid we can get. Um... That we haven't got yet. And I think it is the Majung... It's Majungasaurus and Nundasuchus, I think. It's something like that. It could even be Enosaurus. Um, so I kind of just want to get this to... Oh, come on. What's the highest we can get? Is it 30 or is it higher? Well, I'm, I'm also looking at level 6. I want to... Oh, 40! Yeah, there we go. Can we get another 40, please? Because each hybrid, like, it costs 70 to make from each of these creatures to make, like, to give an attempt anyway. Um, and I get, like, 105 for... Oh! Oh! That, yeah, that was it! 50! Yeah, 400, level 8, 77, and 18. 
We can definitely get it higher than that, though. Definitely. Um, but the other hybrid, you'll notice, I think we've caught every regular dinosaur out there, except for, like, the epics. Um, I think that's a Montosaurus? And Montosaurus, I've barely came in contact with. Um... I was so close. I came across this yesterday and I didn't get I was like, no. I was like, all I need is 40. And I got 30 something. I was like, oh, you were kidding me. So close. But everything else, I think these are all like super hybrids. Um, uh, Pyraptor I did come across as well. So there's only epics and hybrids that we don't have. Everything else, all regular creatures, I think we're good. Uh, also, I've been collecting a lot of raptors because we need raptor level 15 in order to get um, Indominus Rex, as well as T-Rex level 15. So if I'm gonna, like, spend coin on anything, it's probably raptor because we want that Indominus Rex. Is that enough for level 7? Oh, it's so close! Oh, we don't have enough! Oh, no. Um, okay, the other hybrid I was wanting, I think it's this one. Yeah, it's Majungasaurus and Nundasuchus. So at this mo at the moment in time, there's no point to uh, level up Nundasuchus, no point to level up Majungasaurus or Enosaurus, because they've got hybrids, and the hybrids are going to be better than them, to be honest. There it is, 837, 336 attack, so it's more attack than anything. Uh, when I fought it in the top- Oh, there it is, level 7! <gasps> One extra DNA, and we've leveled up our uh, free crate as well. So that's pretty good. And it has like four attacks. That's so good. I don't think I'm going to level that up just yet. But because this has probably been a really long episode, we'll do the crates and then we'll do some battles. Uh, I'll say like, I'll probably tomorrow, maybe actually no, tomorrow. Tomorrow I'm going on a train. Ooh, that'll be interesting to see if I could. Because you're going so quick. I wonder if it'll register. I don't think it will actually. So what's the epic? <gasps> One T-Rex DNA. Awesome. Now, these are better ones. These are like eight hours, I think, these ones. So, 542 coins. 15 darts. I'll take two. But I actually do need these at the moment. 270. Uh, ooh. Yeah, that's another uh, creature I need to get. Oh, four Pyroraptors. Not too bad. We'll get this one as well. 600 coin. 15 darts. Some batteries. Yeah, more Stego. A little bit more Gorgosuchus. And... Oh, oh no, <laughs> what a way. Oh, you're kidding me. What a way from Sinceratops. Oh, you little buggy. Okay, but the, what was, there was one I was going to upgrade. I was like, oh yeah, that's right. This, this guy is like a, a rare. So um, we'll definitely level this guy up. Um, because he has 20% defense and is faster than sauropods and even T-Rexes. So that, this guy might be really good. It depends how many I've got. Ah, oh, damn. Maybe level 9 would be a lot better. Um, so, is there any dinosaurs that I should put in that I haven't? Because I did this last episode. Um, some dinosaurs that I got. Utah Raptor. That's it. I want to switch in Utah Raptor because it's speedy. And we'll switch it out for... We'll switch it out for a Margosaurus because we've already got a Sauropod. So, we'll switch out... Uh, oh, sorry. Argentinosaurus, I think it is. Um, is that it? Oranosaur is pretty good. Eupocephalus is good as well. But what dinosaur do we want to see that we haven't really? Uh, how about the new hi like that hybrid we've got? Um, wait, Stegoceratops, of course. What we're doing? <laughs> um, I kind of want to put. In pro you know what? We'll take out one of the T Rexes because we've already got one. We'll take out that T Rex and because they're basically the same. We'll put in Stegoceratops. Um, now, Amargosaur we haven't seen. Top row, we haven't seen. Uh, bottom row, we've all seen before. Is there any dinosaurs that we could switch out for anything in here? Anything that's pretty good. Um, yeah, I haven't seen Spinosaurus, but I don't know. You know what? Yeah, we'll put in Spinosaurus just because I know you guys will probably want to see it. There'll be at least one person who will want to see it. And we'll switch out... We'll switch out Woohoosaurus, even though it's really good. Yeah, we'll switch out Woosaurus anyway. Um, to Spinosaurus level. I'm only level 6 at the moment. And here we go! Into the battle! Let's go! And, uh, yeah. Ooh, you excited? I'm excited. I want to see all these new dinosaurs. I want to see how good... I want to see the T-Rex. I want to see Stegoceratops. That's what I want to see. If we see any yellows down there, that'll be them. Oh. Era Nublar Jungle. Three. Come on! Oh, there's one! Yeah! Oh, did it just... Oh, the music died. No! Oops! I turned the music off. Oh, two seconds, guys. Right, here we go. Yes. 
Defeated three dinosaurs. What do we have? Is that a T-Rex? Well, we do have Stegas. Oh, we got Spino as well this time. I'm going to put in Proceratosaurus first. Come on, you. Let's get his attack down. Oh, see? That's the speed that you need. Because if I get to go first, I can nerf his... He's 50% less attack now. So, 207 instead of 414 there. Um, I could slow him down. You know what? We'll do that. Why not? Yeah, let's do that. Because we do more... We do like 0.5 extra damage there. So, yeah, he's doing nothing to us now. He's, he's, oh, it even switches. Capra Suchus in. Okay. Uh, oh, he's quicker though. Yeah, I think we're gonna, we may just survive this because I'm gonna nerf him down to 50% health. Um, he's still quicker, but I think, is he gonna switch? Oh, increased attack by how much? Oh, that was an extra 50%. So he, um, he got, like, he's on regular attack now. And I think now he's even higher. So we're putting Spinosaurus. There's Spinosaurus. Oh, he's massive. Bone breaker. Oh, God. Adrenaline surge. He regenerated? Oh, no. Get him, Spinosaurus. Bam. There we go. So he's, he's vulnerable. So that's interesting. What does that mean? So 902. <laughs> what? Spinosaur gets him. There it is. Oh, are, are we dead, though? Because of that bleed? Oh, no, Spino! Oh, damn. Okay, let's bring in Stegoceratops. Yeah! There it is. Okay, let's. we have to go for a regular. We're quicker. And now, because we're faster, uh, we might stun them with our regular head. And we did 800! Um. Hello? There we go. Okay, so we'll do a stun. That should kill it. Oh, 692. He's stunned. And let's finish it with that of like fourth attack. Velocity strike. Bam. That was quick. Oh, wait, no. Oh, he's on two. Oh, but we're way quicker because we got the velocity strike. 600. Oh, but he may switch. Is it going to switch? Even if Oh, we're stunned. Well, we would have been stunned, but we go first. So is he going to switch? Oh, oh, for Kodan comes in. It's 2-2. Two, two. Cutting it close. Um, is he quicker? He's not quicker. Should we go? We'll try the minimal stun attack. 10% chance to stun him. Is it going to work? Damn. But that's it. I think he's probably going to switch. So we'll go for the uh, deceleration. He does switch. And that is it. Done. That was easy. Even with like level 6 Spinosaurus. Um, like weighing our team down. We defeated them so quickly. <gasps> Ooh, one more victory and we're into the next league. However, I'm going to save that for another video because as soon as we go, like I haven't shown it, but every time you go into another league, you get a DNA drop, like a supply drop, and it's it's got so much stuff in it. So I kind of wanted to record that. Um, so I think, you, yeah, you unlock all like DNA from all of those dinosaurs. It's not just the ones in that league. Oh, yeah, I still haven't seen Postosuchus. That's the only dinosaur I haven't seen. And... Apart from that, that means there's only four dinosaurs. Um, I've seen its hybrid because I've, I've like attempted to catch its hybrid. Where is it? It's not Gorgosuchus. Yeah, that's it. It's Postamurodon or Postmetrodon. I think I had two chances to get it. And apparently I've got it once because... I haven't even got post to Sucus and we got 49 DNA for it. We're almost halfway on getting that. But guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you later. Oh, bye bye